My name is Kristen Wilson. I'm the Senior Vice President of Member Services and Programs for ASVA, and I'm gonna give you three tips today to help manage your time. Now, I don't know about you, but I have people coming in and out of my office every single moment of every single day, which is great. It means we have a wonderful culture here. We have an open door policy, but what's not so great is sometimes it can be really difficult to get all my work done. So here's three tips of how I try and manage the constant flow of distractions every day. Number one, so all of you probably use some sort of email management tool. We use Outlook here. And how many of you ever seen those little pop-up windows that come up when you have a new email? That is one of the most distracting things that happens to me during the day. So there's a little tool that'll help you turn those off and you'll be amazed at how much more work you can get done because you're not constantly looking at your computer going, oh, I have a new email. The second thing is actually kind of cool. I went to a time management class, gosh, it's probably been a couple years ago now, and they gave me this wonderful little pebble here and I keep it on my desk and basically what it reminds me to not do is multitask. I know you're probably shocked. Everyone tells you you should multitask. That's what you say in your interviews. That's what makes you a better employee. But technically multitasking is really not that great because you may think you're doing 10 things really efficiently but if you ever got to the end of the day and you didn't finish any of them, yeah, I do it all the time. So I always look at my little pebble and it reminds me not to multitask and to stay focused on what I'm doing. The third thing is, every night before I leave work, I work on my personal workspace. So I put away all my papers that have scattered across the desk, and I also make a note of everything that I need to accomplish the next day. I have a really handy notepad that someone gave me, and it tells me all of my priorities that I want to focus on, both at work and personally, because we all know we all have a personal life when we leave work that we need to manage just as effectively as our work life. So there's your three tips. Make sure that you turn off that little annoying email notification. You use something visually that'll remind you not to multitask as often. And be sure that you take some time at the end of the day to declutter your desk and your mind to prepare you for the next day. So there's your tips. Have an amazing day.